Amadeus, two centuries ago. Little Amadeus, the star of Rococo, master of harmonies, beautiful melodies, operas and symphonies, each one a masterpiece. However, there's an envious rival trying to put traps in your way. But he'll always end up failing whenever you begin to play. And when we hear your magic music, all sorrows fly away. Little Amadeus, your music and your sound. Little Amadeus, they make the world go round. No matter what will be with your fantasy, you'll make it finally, cause music is the key. The Bird Teller. needed only tough luck today oh boy and the keys lay upstairs on the board Amadeus Amadeus he can't hear me Amadeus well well it's Friday the 13th the day isn't over yet is it you're so right Mr. Hagenar thank you anyway hello who's there nobody that's all right with me what a storm it is today oh oh Oh! Oh! <clears throat> oh boy! Cat, have you eaten Birdie after all? Friday the 13th, the black day. Mr. Hagenau's right. My Birdie! Chaser, where's the canary? I don't know. It is, I think. Oh, where's my Birdie? Oh! <laughs> Laura, spit it out! Chazel? I don't know. Who opened the cage? What is going on here? You, Amadeus, did you try to teach the birds some new flying tricks? That's not funny at all. I didn't open the cage. What's going Birdie on here? Is, is gone. Oh, Nanerl, he'll come back. He loves you so much. And what if the cat has eaten him? <laughs> then his belly would be much fatter, wouldn't it? The little bird has flown away, but will come back some other day. It sure Stop comes it. back you, you, another you always day. Fool around. We still don't know what really happened. You're sure? But I'm sure he's okay. Cage door open, window open. He's gone, obviously. <laughs> Oh, maybe he's got one. Don't worry, sister. I'm sure we'll find him. I promise. <laughs> the cage was open. The canary is gone. Nanel is totally desperate. Are you talking about Nanel's canary? You know what? People say that a bird seller's coming to town today. A bird seller? Hey, we must go there right away. Whee! <laughs> Whoa! Why such a hurry? Earth will have you caught a cold? Nanerl's canary has flown away! We want to see the bird seller. Maybe we'll find another canary for her. Calm down, calm down. Do you want to buy a bird? Question, do you have any money? Um, we don't. You're right. We need money. Nothing is for free. How much is such a bird? Not too expensive. Well, for the benefit of Nanerl, follow me into the shop. I'll give you some coins. But in return, you must sweep away the leaves. That's a deal. We'll do it when we get back. And put your scarf on, Urza. Yes. yes. <laughs> ah, there they go, and Birdie is already out of their minds. So I have to look for him on my own. There's a bird seller in town. People uh, say he's got it? some very interesting birds with him. You mean the famous? The one yes. and only Golden Eagle? Fantastic! Listen, it says here, because of his majestic appearance, the Golden Eagle is called King of the Air. He is a strong but lonesome hunter. Kings and princes have chosen him as a heraldic animal. He gives them power and makes mm. them invincible. And pigs may fly. <laughs> Horrible creatures. <laughs> you taste good to him, even when without salt and pepper. 
Invincible. That's the word. But the most important thing is not said here. It's an old mythical secret. And he who writes with an eagle's feather can compose grandiose melodies. Wonderful. <laughs> he sweeps up the big prize after a sudden nosedive from on high. Mm -hmm. That's what happens. I will pluck each single feather out of that bird wonder. He'll become a naked Shut bird. Shut up! What do rats know about royal birds? <laughs> <laughs> Such an eagle would fit me well. Just like it would fit a king or a conqueror. And it could teach me a lot. It would help us in all our future plans. <laughs> Invincible. A golden eagle, what a splendid sight. By just looking at him, you get invincible? Hopefully, if not, he must look for another master. Good idea! Oh, shut up, Monty. Let's go, Mario. We are going to pinch this bird of prey. <laughs> And then Nano's canary flew away, out of the cage. Oh, oh, what a pity, but what have I to do with it? Do you have No, ma'am, yeah. I've just sold my last parrot in Vienna. How about a parakeet? <laughs> I have a special offer here. It speaks three languages, is easy care and housebroken. I hope he can help us. Here, you see, the Duke of Traverstein Wildberg owns one and he's very pleased about I it. I just wonder, do you think Nano's canary will come back? <laughs> uh? Will he find his way home? What? Uh, oh, yeah, the canary. Well, if the cat hasn't eaten it, there's still a chance. Uh, but I'm not sure about it. I'm a bird seller, not a bird catcher. And now, beat it. I have some to do here. But we want to buy a canary right now, to be on the safe side. Well, in that case, here. Look at this beauty. Deep lemon, noble breed with a pedigree, winterproof, easily satisfied, and he can sing like the prima donna from the opera house in Vienna. How much is the lemon? Oh, um, almost nothing. I give you a special price. Only... Hey, leave Daddy! it, rascal! I can't see the bird wonder from here. Perhaps it has died. The bird is here. <laughs> I'm I can sorry. feel it is near. I feel its power. It already penetrates me. It won't be long now, and the whole world will be my oyster. Look over there. Some other people are interested in birdies, too. What the devil? <clears throat> I mean, for heaven's sake. The pain in the neck wants to have that bird, too. I don't think so. Anyway, better safe than sorry. Time to do something. It's too late for an ordinary deal, my dear merchant. Let us get the fried chicken. Okay, let's grab the fried chicken, if we have to. Let's hide behind the bush and then watch what Monty can do. What a bird, what a power, and soon it will be all mine. <laughs> <laughs> How much is this pretty bird? Oh, I thought I just heard something. Well, let me think. I would say it's... <laughs> what is this? Am I out of my mind? Is it a nightmare? Or oh, my possessions? I've flown away. Bye-bye, canaries. Uh-oh. <gasps> How did this happen? What kind of a trick was that? Yes, I'd like to know this too. Bird robbers, bird Catch thieves. Catch them if you can. <laughs> Indeed. Out with it. You have done this. You've ruined me. You and your canary story. You just wanted to distract me. No, we wanted to. Oh. We better beat it, friends. Otherwise, he will grow wild. Can he get any wilder? Oh, you're thieves. Oh. Oh. This is not a bird, but a man I hope catcher. you won't sell us as rare parakeets. This means trouble. I'm sure you'll find a bigger cage. The cage of the Episcopal Guard. I know them. They're nice. Even though they're not very musical. They will teach you how to sing, for sure. Guards! Guards! Help me! I think he's serious. You have to arrest some thieves here. <laughs> The only one left is my eagle, Mario. I Hurry. knew it would be me. <laughs> Hurry, you coward! Here comes your majesty. 
the king of the air. Ah, oh, well, his majestic charisma needs some time to unfold, I suppose. I will have somebody build him a large golden cage. This one looks like a seat from a kitchen, I find. The right thing for a fried chicken. Shut it will up, smell Max. nice. No insults, please. Don't you forget that I was the one who managed everything concerning this lame turkey here. You are so right. Well done, Monty. Well done, Mario. Mm -hmm. You're welcome, Uncle. But what happens next? Grill him. Spice him with paprika. We'll take him with us. Are you sure? Well, of course I'm sure. This bird is just what I need. I wonder if the bird sees it that way. Birdie! 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 I say, that's the little Mozart bird. I'm what have you been up to again? having freed a thousand birds and spiriting one so away. So is it true what people say? It is not true what people say. That's not my problem. At the moment, you're here in custody. But I can explain everything to the bishop. The bishop? The bishop is busy. Important audience. He will brew you later. Oh, that's very nice of him. But how about another riddle? Not today. We've got our instructions. This lock here can easily be cracked. Ugh! Mm, isn't it cozy in here between all these rats and spiders? That's not very funny. I want to get out of here. Come on, Pippa, you must protect me. Good dog. If we shout loud enough, somebody might hear us. Help! Yes, you're right. Help! You too, Amadeus. One, two, three. Help! I feel a mighty inspiration rising. I can feel its power. And now, a feather for an immortal melody. Shh, be quiet. They are crying for help. <laughs> Serves but them what right. if the Archbishop hears it? Mario is right. Do something, Master. I will. My musical storm will blow away this mild breeze of crying for help. How did you like it? One of my new compositions. Well, almost mine. Very nice. Yeah. Amadeus may roar till kingdom come. Nobody will hear him. Anyway, I think I've heard this piece before. Possibly. I play it once in a while here in this sacred place. It sounds worse than your organ grinding. Throw this creature out! Lock it up in the kitchen! Certainly not. You had better bring him to the chamber next door, Mario. His majestic sounds could betray us and make the door and the window soundproof. Nothing may be heard outside. Oh, Mario, bring me some of his feathers. Friday the 13th is such a good day for evil plans. It will become a big success. This could also be a heartbreaking composition of mine. Unfortunately, it has already been composed. I think it's high time for the one that further to help him. Hmm. Quiet! Who's playing there? Who's torturing the keys? And who's shrieking to it? What? There's only one person there who can do it. Anyway, he who makes music can't be a bad guy. He who plays that bad can be. Kayatan, how far have you got with the lock? This lock is too tricky. My Swiss knife has failed. Otherwise, we'd be free already. It's Friday the 13th. Perhaps Amadeus could play some music for us. Then somebody will come and let us out of here. Because I'm getting so cold. It is so good chill in here. Do you see an organ in here? Or a violin? Not even a piano Thank you. stool. But you could search your trousers, Kayatan. Maybe you can find something useful in your portable toolbox. I have a piece of wood here. I use it as a pea shooter for cherry stones. That's all. So you don't have a fiddle? No cembalo? Not even a cymbal? Not even the smallest flute. Just a moment. Did you say flute? Only the freshest vegetables for you today, ma'am. Ah. Have you seen my canary? Mine has flown away from its cage this morning. Oh, again this stupid birdie story. I don't want to hear it anymore. I see you want to visit your friends in the dungeon. Guards! What? I just Guards! wanted to... Guards! So, Amadeus is in the dungeon. Oh, I 
almost useless. This bird is totally unmusical, and its power hasn't strengthened me yet. It makes me feel cramped. It is preventing me from playing my organ. Oh, Since you're not going to turn this marabou into a sausage, you'd better give him to the Archbishop as a present. What do you think? Everybody will soon learn that this bird has been stolen. Why that? Just tell him you found the thief and took the eagle away from him. The thief escaped. He was wearing a mask and you couldn't identify him. This sounds good to me. It could work. Huh? Hmm? <clears throat> Come in. His Excellency the Archbishop is asking Mr. De Villiers to proceed immediately and without any delay to the audience room, where he shall help to solve a very important problem His Excellency is not able to solve by himself. Anything else? Oh, yes. I also have to inform Mr. De Villiers that His Excellency the Archbishop has offered a price for anyone who will catch the thief of his golden eagle. Your Excellency shall meet the bishop right away. Yes, I understand. Thank you. Tell the Archbishop I'm already on my way. Hmm. The Archbishop's golden eagle, it was for the Archbishop? He ordered it? Why didn't he tell me? Maybe it's a birthday surprise for you. Oh, he never gave me anything more valuable than a flower vase. Oh, I'm so very hungry. I need something to eat right now. It's so cold in here. Achoo! Kayaten, have you finished? Yes. We will all be free in a minute. Here. Kayaten, that's super. It worked. Now I can start. Here. This will warm you. Oh, thank you. Mm. Good afternoon, Your Excellency. Where have you been all day long? I have a hundred guests here. My schedule is full and you are not around. Everybody was looking for you. People are humming by, um, coming by. They are telling me who the thief is. Everybody wants the reward. <laughs> I need you here, de Villiers. I want my beagle, um, eagle back, and the bird seller has to be paid too, otherwise he will be penniless. You must lock the thief up in the dungeon, where he will have the company of spiders, rats, and mice. Rats in company with thieves? No, no, never. What did you say? Mm, I, I didn't say have anything. Have you found the culprit? But of course I have, Your Excellency. And where is he? As you ordered, in our dungeon, freshly caught and convicted. Really? Hmm? It wasn't planned like this. <laughs> the bishop can't hear us. Nobody can hear us. They're all deaf out there. Maybe you should step closer to the window so they can hear you better. I can't reach up there. So climb on my shoulders. Yes, that's a good idea. Can you play a bit faster? I don't know if I can hold you much longer. You must. I can't stand it here any longer. Ooh. Amadeus! Hey, halt! Uh? You can't go in here. Hey, hey come back here. Come back. Come back. Come back. Come back. Will the bird robbers shall atone for this crime? Promise? I just said so. Take care of it and think of a just punishment. Everything is already arranged. The cat of nine tails is waiting for them. The what? Oh, excuse me, Excellency. I meant the whip. I see. Amadeus! Halt! Hey, uh, an attack! Guards! You are fired. Amadeus! Don't Amadeus, you, uh, dungeon! No. Free uh, them! Guards! <laughs> Leave the window open. Where is this coming from? It sounds like music from Little Amadeus. Oh, heavenly phrases. How can this be? Just where is it coming from? Out of the dungeon. America. This is some huh? kind of miracle. Watch and listen to what's going on How there. Happen? It's a wonder, a wonderful miracle. That's what I said a moment ago. All the birds are back again. All, but the golden eagle is still in... What Where? does he mean by that? I mean, it is in... is... somewhere... somehow... You look so stale. Well, pale. Aren't you feeling well? <laughs> the 
That's not allowed. Leave the cage closed. Uncle Davilius will grill us for this. You better stop that. I'm only just beginning, and you are wrong. I will save your Uncle Davilius by doing this. T -t 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 Tell your uncle I did it all for him. I take back the fried chicken thing, you king of the... <laughs> you uh, mean show of me. That was it. You'd better write your last will. Bye bye, Birdie. Cry, baby. If you ever understand, let me know. Luckily, he's gone. Luckily for me. Huh? Uh, I'm a yeah. It was about time, too. <laughs> I just couldn't hold him a minute longer. Show me the wonderful flute, Amadeus. You've drawn the most beautiful tones out of it. Oh, it's cold here in the ruins. By the way, what are you doing here? Hmm, never mind. Won't you play it again in my private room? I Wait! Uh, your Excellency, put him off the punishment. This trio was caught red-handed when they were stealing the... Uh, you mean when they were luring the birds with this wonderful newt flusic? Um, flute music? A real magical yes. uh, I mean, no. I myself have... We have nothing to do with the incidents on the marketplace. We only wanted to buy a new parakeet for Nano. And all of a sudden, all the birds what? flew away. Like Nano's canary did before. Oh, lame excuses. I'm not so sure if you should make such allegations here, De Villiers. Um, tell me more about this golden eagle thing. Uh, uh, Everybody take cover. <laughs> Joe, uh, thanks for infecting me. Side of the thirteenth. <laughs> I can't. Oh, it tickles. Oh, I had better go and look after the guests. How very strange. He wasn't interested in that before. <laughs> what is it, Doctor? I must catch him immediately. He belongs to. To whom? Oh, to your excellency. Right. And he looks as if he's coming to me voluntarily. It's so big and strong and of such an age, it can't be kept in a birdie's cage. It's such a shame. But Amadeus might be right. Such a bird must be free. So let it lie um, fly away. De Villiers, give the bird seller the money for the eagle. There's just one question I have. Your Excellency, what did you order this bird for? It's a birthday surprise for... Why, thank you. <laughs> for my sister, the abbess of the Monastery of the Silent Sisters. She loves such mighty animals, like you do, de Villiers, right? Give the devil his due. What an imposing headdress. <laughs> oh, de Villiers, before you clean up, you'd better pay the bird seller. <laughs> Where are you going? I'm going to buy a canary for Nano from the bird seller. You? Why you? I cleaned the cage and must have forgotten to close it afterwards. Hello, children. Is that my birdie? It must be yours. And you have found it? <laughs> birdie. Are you my birdie? I didn't have a canary that could whistle so wonderfully. The melody. Birdie learned it from you. Now we just have to sweep away all the leaves. Or we give your mom the money back and you do oh. it alone. <laughs> it was only a joke. We'll all help you. Can't you play the flute again, Amadeus? So that the leaves will make their way voluntarily into the we basket? We better not strain the magic flute too much. What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> World. He is smart and evil. Welcome to Monty's world. He is small, but he will show you all how he stands tall. There's much to discover with Monty. Hello, children. Do you remember Cayetan carving a little flute out of a wooden blowpipe? That wasn't magic. No, it goes like that. First, you need such a pipe. Nowadays, you can use other materials than wood. For instance, cardboard or plastic. 
In these pipes, you simply must cut holes of different sizes. Then, if you blow into a pipe and keep different holes closed, you will hear different tones. The detailed construction manual, and much more of course, you will find on our website, little-amadeus.com. Have fun with it, my friends, says Monty. Little Amadeus, two centuries ago. Little Amadeus, the star of Rococo. Master of harmonies, beautiful melodies, operas and symphonies, each one a masterpiece. However, there's an envious rival trying to put traps in your way. But he'll always end up failing whenever you begin to play. And when we hear your magic music, all sorrows fly away. Little Amadeus, your music and your sound. Little Amadeus, they make the world go round. No matter what will be with your fantasy, you'll make it finally, cause music is the key.